Oh, the atmosphere here at Dymotech is definitely just like the name says, dynamic. It's the first place and the only place I've ever worked where I feel a part of a family. I work here and that makes me feel a part of a team. So it's like my work team and my family team. When things are maybe not going so great on a personal side, one of my coworkers, no matter what level of the company, from the CEO all the way down to the janitor, will say, Turquoise, what's wrong? Smile, cheer up. That's the type of vibe we have here. Well, I think the general stigma of, of manufacturing is a, a hot, dirty environment. And coming to Dymatech, you walk out on the floor and you see clean, um, air-conditioned environments with top-of-the-line automation. Um, really, I had no experience to manufacturing in, at all um, before coming to Dymatech. And coming to Dymatech really opened my eyes in breaking the stigma of what manufacturing is and really how important it is to, to the economy and, and bringing these jobs to Connecticut. Manufacturing here is a lot cleaner. Um, it's a lot more precise than a lot of other places I've been. Um, we deal with uh, process development and a lot more um, tighter tolerances on our processes. LSR molding is, is significantly different than straight plastic, thermoplastic injection molding. Uh, although the equipment is, is somewhat similar, there's a lot of options that we add on. Uh, vacuum systems and the ability to control the uh, mold temperatures as well. Uh, the the uh, injection barrels are hard and the material is very uh, abrasive and we have to add pump systems to uh, to the mold, uh, to the presses. The molds themselves are very complex. Uh, they have to be tight within two ten thousandths of an inch. They run at about 375 degrees Fahrenheit. So the levels of complexity are much more significant than, than straight thermoplastic molding. So last year, we, uh, I was really impressed with the team, our operations group. What they did was they really fine-tune our efficiencies and operations and to the point that uh, world-class levels of scrap and returns. And uh, so it was a lot of uh, heavy lifting. I think the 40X program also helped with some of those outputs. And uh, we also landed uh, a few new, very big customers uh, to make continue the, the future being bright. Oh, our company is known for our technology. Uh, our technology is second to none. We have the best technology I know in the Northeast. Um, we do two-part silicone molding, which is very, very hard to do. Um, and we, we really exercise our expertise in that. Uh, the other thing that we do is we have Master Molder certified people here amongst myself um, that um, really do a good job at, at maintaining our processes. I feel pretty proud to be a processor in 2017, especially when I look at it as possibly a shrinking market, a shrinking profession. And it wasn't too long ago, uh, there's roughly around 7,000 molders in the States. That number was going to be directed closer to five. And having these niche technologies are what create the differentiators that keep us on the map.